My latest visit here to Emirates Equestrian Centre is to visit two of the younger horses who've been rehomed by Dar Al Kale. Fittingly, to two of the younger riders who are taking part in the Life After Racing League. Here we have Leone on Pasticcio and Alex is riding Publication. I've been riding, having lessons for quite a while and I was just looking for something to take my riding to the next level and we thought that um, taking an x race horse would be a great challenge, not only for me, but just to help um, pubs would be, I mean we're both learning so much and I think it's just a really great experience and an opportunity. His progress is just exponential. We started off, I don't think we even cantered until month three and now we're jumping, I think month six and he's just, he's been really incredible. At the beginning we had a lot of problems turning and he just overcame all of these issues so easily and he's just really, he's become such an amazing horse and he's just got such a nice temperament and he's just so lovely. Uh, at the uh, LAR Awards night we came first in the junior in-hand showing. I had never done in-hand showing before, we just thought we'd give it a try. He's beautiful and it's just, it all came together and we ended up winning that um, overall and we entered our first arena eventing just in the 40 centimetres class. He was amazing, we just nice and steady and we came first in that as well so he's a born winner. <laughs> I love to do the eventing, eventually get some cross country going, do some show jumping classes so and eventually get up to eventually maybe 90, one metre with him because I think he's so scopy and he really has a lot of potential. Because of school, I will ride during the weekends and my mum will ride during the week and then it's just really nice because we can come up together, spend some time, look, ride some horses. It's just an amazing evening. <laughs> It's only been three months and um, it's been a joy really. A few little downs and ups but along the way we're getting there and he's a really sweet horse and he's a bit nervous. I took him to a few shows last season and he kind of gets a bit nervous with the speakers so we're working on that but um, he's doing really well in both dressage and jumping and hoping to compete him next season. Obviously knew he wasn't the easiest, you know, he has his days, um, but it's always been a childhood dream of mine to train an off-the-track thoroughbred, so in a way my dream came true and it's really nice working with a big horse because I used to work with a smaller pony, mm -hmm. so it's very different but it's really fun. I guess I just find them so versatile, you know, when they come off the track, they can do so many different things, obviously jumping and the dressage and, you know, lots of hacking and... It's nice to be able to have experience in training a horse, so I thought that that would be great for my experience as I aspire to be an equine sports therapist someday, so I thought that would be a good skill set.